imagine how good this would be? Your Highness, with all due respect, it might not be the wisest thing to change everything so quickly. You might experience some resistance. Yes, I do not think the people are ready for it. There's just too much change. No. There's too much responsibility that we'd be put on them. We can't handle it. Maybe we should just keep things how we've always done it. That sounds like a good plan to me. But can't you see how bad the things have become in the kingdom? We must change things. Sir, you don't need to worry about what's happening outside of these gates. He's right, your highness. You're well taken care of in here. Let us worry about what's happening outside of these castle walls. And, oh my goodness, would you look at the time. I'm sorry, gentlemen, but we're about all out for today. Uh, King Joseph will take all of your opinions into thoughtful consideration, but as for now, he's got an early bedtime, so um, we'll meet back tomorrow, okay? How's that? Okay, here we go. Bart, I just don't understand why they're not more excited. King Joseph, the council has had their way in the kingdom for a long time, and you're just trying to come up and sort of mess up their own happy world. They'll never support you with something this radical. But look, if you want to change the kingdom so radically, you're going to have to do it yourself. It's up to you. If I don't follow the advice of my council and fail, I'm going to look so foolish. With all due respect, council members, who does this kid think he is? He can't just come in here and change everything we've worked so hard for. But I can't sit back and watch, knowing what is going on outside of these castle walls. I must do something. Just wait. He'll come back tomorrow and eat his words. He's too afraid of the power that we have as a council. There's just so much to do. I don't even know where to begin. I don't know, though. He did seem pretty serious. I'm not ready for this. He's a coward. <laughs> what am I gonna do?